to me, cryptocurrency has two different faces in a way. It has a systemic face, and that is usually originates in the countries where uh, much of the programming and the investment happens, i.e. America and Europe and Asia to a greater and greater extent. And I think that there's something about cryptocurrency which lends itself to people who think about big systems mm. and who think about emergent phenomena. So, you know, you set rules and then you see what emerges from people following those rules. And then it has this other face, which takes place in what people often call the developing world, uh -huh. which is very individualistic 